regular expressions. Regular expressions, often shortened to regex or regexp, are patterns that help programmers match, search, and replace text. Regular expressions are really powerful, but can be hard to read because they use special characters to make more complex, flexible matches. In this course, you will learn how to use special characters, capture groups, positive and negative, positive and negative, look heads, and other techniques to match any text you want. Using the test method, regular expressions are used in programming languages to match parts of the string. You create patterns to help you do the matching. Help you do that matching. If you want to find the word, the in the string, the dog chased the cat. You could use the following regular expression. The notice that quote marks are not required within the regular expression. JavaScript has multiple ways to, re to, to use regex. One way to test a regex is using the test method. The test method takes regex, applies to it, applies it to a string, which is placed inside the parentheses, and returns true or false if your pattern finds something or not. Let test string free code cam. Let test regex code. Test regex test test string. The test method here returns true. Apply the regex my regex on the string my string using the test method.
match literal strings. In the last challenge, you search for the word hello using the regular expression hello. That week X search for a literal match of a string hello. Here is another example searching for a literal match of a string Kevin. That test string equal to hello my name is Kevin. That test string X Assign test rig x to Kevin. Test rig x test test stream. This test this test call will return true. Any other forms of Kevin will not match. For example, the rig x Kevin will not match Kevin or Kevin. Let's run rig x Kevin. Run rig x test test stream. This test call. This test call will not will. This test call will return false. A future challenge will show how to match those other forms as well. Complete the regex waddle regex to find waddle in the string. Waddle is hiding with a literal match. Match a little string with the different possibilities. Using regex like coding, you can look for the pattern coding in another string. This is powerful to search single strings, but it's limited to only one pattern. You can use you can search for multiple patterns using the alteration or or operator. This operator matches patterns either before or after it. For example, if you wanted to match the string yes or no, the rig X you want is yes no. You can also search for more than just two patterns. You can do this by adding more patterns with more all operators separating them, like yes no maybe. Complete the rig X pair rig X to match the pets, dog, cat, bird, or fish. Ignore cases while matching. Up until now, you've looked at rig axes to do little matches of strings, but sometimes you might want to also match the case differences. Case or sometimes letter case is the difference between uppercase letters and lowercase letters. Examples of uppercase are A, B, and C. Examples of lowercase are A, B, and C. You can match both cases using what is called a flag. There are other flags, but here you will focus on the flag that ignores case, the I flag. You can use it by appending it to the regex. An example of using this flag is ignore case I. 
These three gags can match the strings ignore case, ignore case, and ignore case. Write the regex FCC regex to match free code cam, no matter its case. Your regex should not match any abbreviation or variations with, with spaces. Extract matches. So far, you have only been checking if a pattern exists or not within a string. You can also extract the actual matches you have you found with match method. To use the match method, apply the, apply the method on a string and pass in the regex inside the parentheses. Here is an example Hello world, match hello. Let our string regular expressions. Let our regex expressions. Our string match our regex. Here is the first match will return hello and the second will return expressions. Note that match syntax is, is the opposite of the test method you have been using thus far. String match regex. Regex test string. Apply the match method to extract the string coding.
Find more than the first match. So far, you have only been able to extract to all search a pattern once. Let test string repeat, repeat, repeat. Let our regex repeat. Test string match our regex. Here, match will return repeat. To search or extract a pattern more than once, you can use the global search flag G. Let repeat regex repeat G. Test string match repeat regex. And here match returns the value repeat repeat repeat. Using the regex star regex, find and extract both twinkle words from the string twinkle star. Note, you can have multiple flags on your regex like search gi. match anything with wildcard period. Sometimes you won't or don't need to know the exact characters in your patterns. Thinking of all words that match, say a misspelling would take a long time. Luckily, you can save time using a wildcard character. The wildcard character will match any one character. The wildcard character The wildcard character will match any one character. The wildcard is also called dot and period. You can use the wildcard character just like any other character in the regex. For example, if you wanted to match hard, 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 and hung, you can use the regex hu dot to match all four words. That hung string, I will hang a sound. Let hug string bear hug. Let who regex h u dot who regex who regex dot test hug string who regex dot test hug string. Both the oh, both of these tests both of, both of these tests calls will return true. Complete regex and regex so that it matches the strings wang, sang, fang, pang, nang, and bang. You regex to use the wildcard character. Match single character with multiple possibilities. You learn how to match literal patterns, literal and wildcard character dot. Those are the extremes of regular expressions. 
where one where one exact matches and the other matches everything. There are options that are balanced between these two extremes. You can search for a little pattern with some flexibility with the character classes. Character classes allow you to define a group of characters you wish to match by placing them inside square brackets. For example, you want to match back, big, and bug, but not ball. You can create a big X, B, A, I, U, G to do this. The A, I, U is a character class that will only match the characters A, I, or U. Let big string big, back string back, bug string bug, box string box, B, G, big X, B, A, I, U, G, big string match, B, G, big X, back string, back string match, BG rig X, box string match BG rig X, box string match BG rig X. In order, the four match calls will return the values big, back, bug, and now. Use a character class with vowels A I O U in the rig X, vowel rig X to find all the vowels in the string call sample. Note. Be sure to match both upper and lower case vowels. Match the letters of the alphabet. You saw how you can use character sets to specify a group of characters to match. But that's a lot of typing when you need to match a large range of characters. For example, every letter in the alphabet. For example, every letter in the alphabet. Fortunately, there's a building. There's a building. There is a built-in feature that makes this short and simple. Inside, inside a character set, you can define a range of characters to match using a hyphen character. For example, to match lowercase letters A for E, you will use A to E. Let cat string cat, bad string bad, mat string mat, BG regex, A to E, AT, Cat string match BG rig X. Bad string match BG rig X. Mass string match BG rig X. In order, the three match calls will return the values cat, bad, and now. Match all the letters in the string call sample. Note: Be sure to match both uppercase and lowercase letters. Match numbers and letters of the alphabet. Using the hyphen to match a range of characters is not limited to letters. It also works to match a range of numbers. For example, 0 to 5 matches any number between 0 and 5, including 0 and 5. Also, it is possible to combine a range of letters and numbers in a single character set. 
Let Jenny stream Jenny A6753209. Let my regex A to G zero to nine IG. Jenny stream match my regex. Create a single regex that matches a range of letters between H and S, and a range of numbers between two and six. Remember to include the appropriate flex in the regex.
match single characters not specified. So far, you have created a set of characters you want to match, but you could also create a set of characters that you do not want to match. These types of character sets are called negative character sets. To create a negative character set, you place a uh, you place a carrot. To create a negative character set, you place a carrot character after the opening bracket and before the characters you do not want to match. For example, A I O U G I matches all characters that are not a vowel. Note that characters like like this and Y space are matched. The negative vowel character set only only excludes the vowel characters. Create a single regex that matches all characters that are not a number or a vowel. Remember to include the appropriate flags in your regex. Match characters that occur one or more times. Sometimes you need to match a character or group of characters that appears one or more times in a row. This means it occurs at least once and may be repeated. You can use this character to check if that is the case. Remember, the character or pattern has to be present consecutively. That is, the character has to repeat one after the other. For example, A plus G will find one match in ABC and return A. Because of the plus, you also find a single match in A, A, B, C and return A, A. If you were instead checking the string A, B, A, B, you will find two matches and return A, A because the A characters are not in a row. There's a B between them. Finally, finally, since there is no A in the string B, C, D, you wouldn't find a match. You want to find matches when the letter S occurs one or more times in Mississippi. Why a big X that uses a plus sign?
match characters that occur match characters that occur zero or more times. The last challenge use the plus sign to look for characters that occur one or more times. There is also an option that matches characters that occur zero or more times. The character to do this is the asterisk or star. Soccer world. Go. G phrase. Got feeling. O phrase. Over the moon. Go regex. Go. Soccer world. Match. Go regex. G phrase. Match. Go regex. O phrase. Match. Go regex. In order, the three match calls will return the values go, g, and now. For this challenge, showing code has been initialized as a string O A A A and A R R R G H behind the scene. Create a regex showing regex that use the asterisk character to match the uppercase A character. Immediately followed by zero or more lowercase a characters in showing quote. Your regex does not need flags or character classes, and it should not match any of the other quotes. Find characters with lazy matching. In regular expressions, a greedy match finds the longest possible part of the string that fits the regex pattern and returns it as a match. The alternative is to code a lazy match, which finds the smallest possible part of the string that satisfies the regex pattern. You can apply regex TA to G, asterisk I, to the string Titanic. This regex is basically a pattern that starts with T, ends with I, and has some letters in between. Regular expressions are by default greedy, so the match will return Titanic. It finds the largest substring possible to fit the pattern. However, you can use the question mark character to change it to lazy matching. Titanic matches against the adjusted regex of T, A to G. Asterisk question mark i returns ti. Note, passing HTML with regular expressions should be avoided. But pattern matching a HTML string with regular expressions is completely fine. Fix the regex to return the b to return the HTML tag h1 and not the tags. Winter is coming. Remember the wild card dot in regular expressions matches any characters match matches any character
find one or more criminals in a hunt. Time to pause and test your new regex writing skills. A group of criminals escaped from jail and ran away, but you don't know how many. However, you do know that they stay close together when they are around other people. You are responsible for finding all of the criminals at once. Here's an example to give you how to do this. The weak X T plus matches the letter T when it appears one or more times in a row. You will find all matches in one of the following strings. But it does not find matches in the following strings since there are no letter there are no letter T characters. Write a greedy weak X that find one or more criminals within a group of other people. A criminal is represented by the capital letter C. Match beginning string patterns. Prior challenges show that regular expressions can be used to look for a number of matches. They are also used to search for patterns in specific positions in strings. In the early challenge, you use the carrot character inside a character set to create a net to create a negated character set in the form. Things that will not be matched. Outside of a character set, the carrot is used to search for patterns at the beginning of strings. First string wiki is first and can be found. First regex wiki. First regex test first string. Not first. You can find wiki round. Not first. You can find wiki now. First regex test not first. The first test call will return true, while the second will return false. Use the carrot character in a regex to find cal only in the beginning of the string, wiki and cal. Match ending string patterns. 
In the last challenge, you learn to use Kerber character to search for patterns at the beginning of strings. There is also a way to search for patterns at the end of strings. You can search the end of strings using the dollar sign character at the end of regex. The ending. This is a never ending story. Story regex story. Story regex has the ending. Let no ending sometimes a story won't have to end. Story regex has no ending. The first test call will return true, while the second will return false. Use the anchor character to match the string caboose at the end of string caboose. Match all letters and numbers. Using character classes, you are able to search for all letters of the alphabet with A to G. This kind of character class is common enough that there is a shortcut for it, although it includes a few extra characters as well. The closest character class in JavaScript to match the, alpha, to match the alphabet is W. This shortcut is equal to A to G, A to G, G to 9. This character class matches upper and lowercase letter plus numbers. Note, this character class also includes the underscore character. That longhand A to G, A to G, G to 9 underscore plus shorthand W plus numbers 42 var, var names important var long hand test numbers short hand test numbers long hand test var names short hand test var names all four of these test calls will return true these shortcut character classes are also known as shorthand character classes Use the shorthand character class W to count the number of alphanumeric characters in various call in in various quotes and strings.
match everything by letters and numbers. You've learned that you can use a shortcut to match alphanumeric, alphanumerics A, G, A, G, 0 to 9 underscore using W. The natural pattern you might want to search for is the opposite of alphanumerics. You can search for the opposite of the W with uppercase W. Note the opposite pattern use a capital letter. This this shortcut is the same as A G A G Q to nine. Shorthand W numbers forty two percent sentence coding numbers match shorthand sentence match shorthand. The first match call will return a value percentage. Um, percentage sign and the second will return exclamation mark use the shorthand character set use the shorthand character class w to count the number of now alphanumeric characters in various quotes and strings Match all numbers. You've learned shortcuts for common string patterns like alphanumerics. Another common pattern is look just for is look is looking for just digits or numbers. The shortcut to look for digit character is D, with lowercase D. This is equal to the character class 0 to 9, which looks for a single character of any number between 0 and 9. Use the shorthand character class D to count how many digits are in movie titles. Return our numbers 6 instead of 6 do not count. Match owner match all now numbers. The last challenge shows how to search for digits using the shortcut D with a lowercase d. You can also search for now digits using a similar shortcut that uses the uppercase D instead. The shortcut to look for now digit character is D. This is equal to the character class 0 to 9, which looks for a single character that's not a number between 0 and 9. Use the shorthand character class for now digits D to count how many now digits are in movie titles. Restrict possible usernames. Usernames are used everywhere on the internet. They are what gives users a unique identity on their favorite sites. You need to check all usernames in a database. Here are some simple rules that, user, that users have to follow when creating their username. Usernames can only use alphanumeric characters. The only number in username have to be at the end. They can be zero or more of length at the end. Usernames Username cannot start with number. Username letters can be lowercase and uppercase. Usernames have to be at least two characters long. A two-character username can only use alphabet letters as characters. Change regex use user check to fit the constraints listed above.